Y'all look at this right here. She's floating like a cork. Yeah. We ain't leaning. We ain't tilting. We ain't swaying. Now look at this. I had to put me on. One of my tree, tree sticks up beside that way. cut every limb out of the trees driveway. just to get it down the driveway but uh everything's good so far y'all so cute yep don't need the outriggers she's she's so she's she ain't top heavy at all like i said even with me up on top it's still not top heavy that means i can put me a chair up there and get some sunshine yeah you can get all the sunshine you want with that gal balloon let me tell you go out there and wave to them folks <laughs> <laughs> we had people following us on the pavement. Uh, you could see their phone in the, oh, yeah. in the glass. Yeah, they ain't worried to think about this. <laughs> Rednecks have come to down. No, but it, oh, it's, yeah. it's doing good, y'all. We're super proud of it. Oh. I'm about to get on top. I ain't been on top. Get on top, kid. Get on top. She ain't got her sea legs under her yet. No. Yeah, you ain't got your safety harness on either. Just step in the middle. Don't step on the ribs, Goof. Anyway, we appreciate everybody. Appreciate y'all. I don't know if y'all remember this pontoon boat that we built uh, several years back for bow fishing. You know, got the four pontoons on it. We put, uh, we've been putting lime out with it, you know, heavy stuff, you know, and putting out catfish boxes. So, uh, hadn't been using it very much. So, I, you know, we were, uh, on the river the other day and saw a houseboat and I said, let's just do that right there. Let's just turn this thing into one of them because it'll float a lot. Keeping it real lightweight, going with two by two walls, going with three eighths uh, plywood on the side. All of this is going to be on mine and Hannah's YouTube. Trying to keep it as lightweight as possible. Uh, had some old windows and stuff out of the travel trailer that we use and so it, so, you know, it's going to be pretty economical. We're trying to keep it as cheap as we can and build it for, you know, thousand twelve fifteen hundred dollars maybe anyway y'all 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 go check it out on youtube we should start posting videos on it pretty quick and the you know the progress and stuff but uh i think it's gonna turn out pretty good you know so far we got a lot of stuff to do and i'm sort of concerned about it being top heavy but uh you know keeping it as light you know like i said as lightweight as possible but all it'll be is like a bunkhouse on the water oh uh, you know that way when we're catfishing or whatever on the lake we can just we can just pull this thing in the back back there it's gonna have generators it's gonna have air conditioners it's gonna have toilet and it's gonna have uh bunk beds and all that stuff in it so uh, i'm hoping it'll work out but uh y'all check it out on youtube and uh should be posting something i don't know in the next week or so on it i'm hoping it won't take too long to finish we're just getting started on it right now so uh anyway it's, it's turning out good had some old windows and doors out of an old travel trailer that we built in Hannah's little tiny house. Oh, had those left over, and that's that's why I'm, that's why I keep everything instead of throwing it away because I know one day I'll use it, and uh, that's what we're doing right here. That's gonna that's gonna be the windows and doors. But uh, it's turning out really good so far. I'm just like I said, I'm concerned about it being a little top heavy, but I think we're gonna be okay. Y'all tell me what you think about it, and uh, maybe we can watch it on YouTube. And, See what you think. Anyway, y'all have a good one. Appreciate y'all. All right, there it is. I hadn't built the outriggers for it yet. I don't know if we're going to need them. I'm going to try it probably tomorrow. And uh, before I build them, just to make sure we're going to need them. But uh, I got some tie downs and everything on the sides. I hadn't built the concrete anchors like I was wanting to. But uh, I'll probably do that sometime this weekend. But it, it's looking pretty good so far. I uh, hadn't put the finish on the outside. I'm going to do something. I don't know exactly what yet, but either clear coat or some sort of stain or something. I don't know. But I uh, got, got it about done on the inside. Oh, uh, Just waiting on mattresses. Hannah's got them ordered. But uh, it should sleep for pretty good. Little cabinet built right there. I can shove uh, fish cookers and stuff in, you know, from the from the front porch, I can just put them right there. Anyway, four beds, oh, a little changing room right here, you know, to put a little portable oh, toilet in there just in case. Got the boxes built outside for uh, to hold the generator and uh, gas and all outside. That's gonna be the little air conditioning right there. 
put a little 5000 BTU air conditioner in here. And uh, well, you see it. I mean, it's come out along pretty good. Just uh, just got to finish up. We don't have any floor covering yet. Probably just going to take some of those carpet rugs and just kick them out on, you know, on the walkway right here because, you know, the majority of it's covered up with beds and cabinets and stuff. So anyway, going to have storage under the, you know, under the bed, you know, under the beds. Pretty good bit. And uh, in this big cabinet right here, put life jackets and fire extinguishers and all that right there. But uh, I can't wait to smell the catfish frying, let me tell you. Got the hook right there, that's where I'm gonna skin them at. Got one on both sides. I can skin two at the time. Mm, can't wait, y'all. Gonna be the floating catch catfish cabin. Y'all have a good weekend, appreciate y'all. Y'all look at this right here. She's floating like a cork. Yeah. We ain't leaning, we ain't tilting, we ain't swaying. You know, look at this, I had to put me on. One of my tree, tree sticks up beside that way. Come on, come on, give you a good view. Huh? How about that? So proud, y'all. So proud. Not top heavy, even with my butt up here. It still ain't top heavy. Look at that view. Can't beat that, folks. Pretty cool, huh? I had to cut every limb out of the trees just to get it down the driveway, but uh, everything's good so far, y'all. So cute. Yep, don't need the outriggers. She's she's so uh, she ain't top heavy at all. Like I said, even with me up on top, it's still not top heavy. That means I can put me a chair up there and get some sunshine. Yeah, you can get all the sunshine you want with that gavelloon, let me tell you. Go out there and wave them folks. <laughs> <laughs> we had people following us on the pavement. Uh, you can see their phone in the, oh, yeah. in the glass. Yeah, they ain't worried to think about this. <laughs> Red bags have come to down. No, but it, oh, it's, yeah. it's doing good, y'all. We're super proud of it. Oh. I'm about to get on top. I ain't been on top. Get on top, kid. Get on top. She ain't got her sea legs under her yet. No. Yeah, you ain't got your safety harness on either. Just step in the middle. Don't step on the ribs, Goof. Anyway, we appreciate everybody. Appreciate y'all.